They called him the Black Edison, but the real Thomas Edison actually sued him, twice. According to Wikipedia, Granville T. Woods was born in Columbus, Ohio in 1856 and left school at age 10 to work. He taught himself electrical engineering by studying at night while working as a machinist and railroad engineer during the day. In 1887, Woods invented the synchronous multiplex railway telegraph, a device that let moving trains communicate with stations and each other using electromagnetic induction. The National Inventors Hall of Fame documents how this invention prevented countless train collisions by allowing dispatchers to track every train's location in real time. Here's the part they don't tell you. Thomas Edison was so threatened by this black inventor's genius that he sued Woods for patent rights. According to the New York Transit Museum, Edison claimed he invented the railway telegraph first. The U.S. Patent Office investigated and sided with Woods, twice. After losing both lawsuits, Edison offered Woods a job at the Edison Company. Woods turned him down flat. He valued his independence more than Edison's money. Over his lifetime, Woods patented over 60 inventions, including telegraphy, sending voice and telegraph over one wire, the electric railway system, improvements to air brakes, and the third rail system still used in subways today. When he died in 1910, he was buried in an unmarked grave it took 65 years before anyone gave him a headstone. If this story made you angry, good. Share it, drop a comment, and subscribe, because history tried to erase him, but we're bringing him back.